and subscribers, mga DJs, mga mobile fanatics there. Thank you for checking our quick video for today. I hope you're all doing okay, safe with your families right at home because we know that there is a lockdown for this corona virus or the COVID-19. But we do not have anything to do today and we'll just have a look of what's inside this Beta 3 speaker cabinet. We'll remove the screws and we'll pull out the speaker driver to let you see what's inside. I have already removed the screws at the top to make the thing quicker. So it has 16 hex type of screw in here. You see that? All right. And we'll lift the cover. So there's the speaker driver itself. That's 18 inches. Uh, it looks beautiful. Sweet. Okay, so uh, try to notice it has uh, these uh, some kind of a register. I don't know what's the uh, term for the uh, uh, side. And it has a lot of these in here. I think that's to, to make the uh, speaker uh, more tougher. I mean, very tight. This speaker don't move real hard like that. It just vibrates and produces a thick thump, uh, thump or, or kick bass sounds. I don't know how you describe it, but uh, for you DJs, you know what I'm talking about. We'll pause the video and remove how many screws in here? Eight screws. We'll pull out the speaker driver. Go. Okay, so we were able to successfully remove eight screws in here and I'm definitely thinking this is a bit heavy because that's 18 inches that's the standard ferrite magnet I'm going to pull it right off the box yeah that's heavy all right and this is the bath I've got some assistance with my kid in here This is really heavy. Okay, well, we're able to pull it out. This is how big it is. This is the basket. Let me lift it up. That's the back side. I'm going to pull it, put it right down. Okay, so that's how it is. Now, uh, l let me show you what's inside the box. A look inside the Beta 3 B118. And that's the amplifier module. Okay, that's how it looks like. Sorry, it's a bit dark. We do not have good lighting uh, outside. Uh, let me try and turn on the flashlight here. Okay, we're going out of focus. Oh, uh, there you go. There's nothing really much uh, to look at that amplifier module. This is the uh, uh, the plunger where you stick your uh, pole mount, your upper speaker driver. Uh, those black uh, thing that you see there are fibers. They're colored black. It's not really recommended to touch these because they're a bit uh, itchy. I think because they're fiberglass, it pierces on your skin really small or tiny enough to make you feel. It's just itchy but it's actually piercing your skin that's the grill and there is the port or the hole where this, uh, the sound comes out now let me focus in the uh, speaker driver over here it's really neat you see that so that's uh, beta 3 that's the sticker it doesn't really say what model it is but I don't know. It's really big. This is the magnet. Okay. This is the mat, the basket. I think it's aluminum. What else is so unique in here? Uh, there's the exhaust, or maybe the port. And uh, when you have a budget to wreck 
one of these, you'll see that those holes shows the voice call deep inside in the dust cap. Alright, so that's the terminal, positive and negative. That's pretty much about it. It's pretty straightforward. So that's the Beta 3 B118 in speaker box. The speaker model is not really stated or it's not printed in the sticker. But we understand that Beta 3 came from Elder Audio. Alright, so there you go guys. Okay, I think we can uh, take a look of the voice call. I see some copper wires in it. I don't know if you can see that too well. Seeing it uh, through the holes around here. I, I see it. I see it. Let me try and zoom it in. No, nope, can't be viewed by the camera. But if you take a look of your naked eye, you'll see that those holes definitely show the voice coil. Anyway, guys, thank you for checking my quick video. A look inside the Beta 3. B118 speaker cabinet and the speaker driver itself practice and enjoy